Hi, I'm Dr. Danielle and I work for Duke NUS Medical School and I work on dangerous viruses and at the moment I'm working on the COVID-19 response. Hi, my name is Kimberly and I am 10 years old. My question is, who was the first person to get the coronavirus and how did it spread so far? My name is Oliver, I am 5 years old. I want to know how fast the coronavirus spreads. So we don't know exactly who the first person was that uh, got this virus, but we do know the city where it came from. So originally the virus came from a city in China called Wuhan. And what, what happened was there were people that were sick in hospital and the doctors were wondering what's going on with these patients. There's something weird happening and there's several <coughs> patients with the same disease. And what they found out is it's a new virus. and. Then they figured out what sort of virus it was and found out that it was a coronavirus. And this virus spreads very quickly. <coughs> and one of the reasons why this virus does spread so quickly is people are able to pass it on to each other. But then people also travel. So they traveled outside of their city, outside of their country. And then this is how we saw the virus spread worldwide. Hi, I'm Armand. I'm 10 years old and I would like to know why is COVID-19 a pandemic, but SARS, which is also a type of coronavirus, didn't become a pandemic? COVID-19 is a pandemic, and what that means is it affects a lot of countries and it affects uh, people worldwide. And why this virus is a pandemic where SARS, which is also a coronavirus, wasn't a pandemic, that was an epidemic, is because of how fast this spreads. So one good way to remember what the difference between an epidemic is and a pandemic is remember the P and pandemic for passport. So we, the new, when new viruses appear, if they are able to travel very far, they have the capability of causing a pandemic. Hi, my name is Ethan. Are there different types of coronaviruses? If there is, do you need different types of medicine for each one? There are different types of coronaviruses. Some of them are even able to infect animals. And one of the viruses that we maybe have heard of before is MERS. And this virus can actually infect camels and people. And viruses can infect cats. Some coronaviruses are able to make cats very sick. So the new virus, COVID-19, we need a new medicine because this is a different type of coronavirus and it behaves differently to the other viruses, coronaviruses that we know about. So what we're going to need to find out is different medications, different vaccines for those different viruses. And that's one of the things that we're fighting really, really hard for right now because we need to specifically find a vaccine or a treatment for uh, COVID-19. Although there's different coronaviruses and we're in the middle of an outbreak, there is a good point. So scientists and doctors all over the world are working together to try to find medicines to help people that are sick and help beat this disease. So to learn more about what scientists are doing, tune into the next episode where we'll learn more about the work that they're doing.